I got about a thousand more feet to climb over, I don't know, maybe two miles, one mile? Who cares? Gotta climb it anyway. And then about 11 miles to go until camp for a total of like, uh, 26, 27 miles. Not bad for the first day out of town. So remember yesterday those really amazing granite spires and crags? I believe that is them. Which means I came up over there and then went all the way around to here. Wow, that's fantastic. Really gives you an idea of how much distance you can cover. Um, that stretch into there, that's about eight miles I think. So the last couple hours have been heads down, hiking, just grinding out miles. And then I come around a corner and bam, check that out. This is why we do it. This is why I put up with sore feet and achy bones every single day. God, that is just insane. I'm speechless looking at this. Insane, right? So freaking cool. Good morning. Uh, today is the last full day of uh, this section for me. I'm about to go into Etna. I've got about 18 miles or so left to go. And uh, looking forward to town. Last town I was in was Shasta, but I did an in and out resupply. So I got laundry done, but uh, I did not get a shower and I am so disgusting and smelly. How disgusting you ask? Well let's see. I can smell myself sitting here and um, I've added a new aroma to the potpourri of uh, feet, crotch, and armpit that I usually can smell. I now smell what I can only describe as New York subway bum uh, coming off of my, <laughs> my skin. So I, I feel epically gross. I kept myself awake last night in my tent from the smell. Yeah, nine days without a shower, sweating profusely, not not the best for the stink. I really pity the poor person who picks me up for, for a hitch to go into Aetna, but whatever. Hiker trash. A little speck is a chopper pulling what looks like a container that might be used for firefighting. There is a fire burning a ways north of here, and I presume that's what he's out to fight. Seems like such a small, rinky-dink little basket. It just seems so inefficient to do it that way. What do I know? I'm a bear. I'll suck the heads off a fish. Beautiful. We're gonna climb that trail right around there and I'm gonna go around the ridge and then I have no clue what happens next. And this is where we're going. Gotta go around that corner. There may still be more climbing yet. God, I hope that. I just want McDonald's. It's morning. I'm gonna die.
pretty much at the top of my climb. The rest of the way is downhill and uh, I'm beat. It's been a long, hard day. I didn't get much sleep last night, so I've just been low octane. I'm almost completely out of food except for a few mango slices and um, a couple raisins, like literally a couple raisins and uh, my dinner for tonight, which I'm hoping I don't need. Hoping I can get into Etna and buy some fast food. That would make me very happy, very happy indeed. But we'll see, I got two and a half miles I think to go and then um, a hitch on a road that has very little traffic. So might turn into a camping night, which is what that extra dinner is for. Just in case, just in case. That is some snow. I would like to point out that it is the middle of August and we're not really even up that high. Must have been crazy this winter. 170% snow in the Sierras and pretty heavy dusting in the Cascades too. Yeah. Let it snow. On the next episode see the smoke from the fire coming up over that ridge. Still a lot of smoke from the forest fire. I can smell it. It's in my lungs. It's turning my snot black. Not a great day. I'm in Oregon now. I just found out from another hiker that there's a fire closure in between me and my ultimate destination, which I did not know. Now I need to figure out how to get off trail into a town earlier. So that sucks. Yeah, a lot of planning to do.